Hey guys, so it is like 7.30 in the morning, and normally I'm up at like, I don't know, I wake up at like 6, not 6, I take that back, maybe like 5.30ish to take Dominic to work, and then I go back to sleep until like, you know, 11 or something, or later, because I like to sleep in and I don't have a job right now. Well, anyways, it is 7.30, can y'all guys guess while I'm awake? Because I'm going to the barn, everybody got it right, you're all so smart, I love y'all, y'all are great actually get to go to the barn but first I had to take Bretta out and she decided that she hasn't wanted to poop yet so I don't know but anyways so there's a whole reason why I'm going to the barn and I'll tell you all about that in a little bit I don't know how much I'm gonna be able to actually record of the barn because the barn owner is actually a really private lady um, if y'all follow me on my personal Instagram y'all will know that I went up to one of their practices and I took some pictures of the girls and um, I haven't been allowed to post the pictures yet now of course if I ask the girls I think she went poop now of course if I ask the girls and they tell me that they're okay to post then I can go ahead and post them and y'all get to see some you know more horses turning barrels instead of me reposting pictures all the time because I haven't seen my horse in five months so that's great let me go take her in and then I'll head to the barn and maybe I can get some videos of horses and stuff at the barn. It's so foggy this morning. It's letting, it's going up a little bit. Whenever I took Dominic to work this morning, you know, it was dark outside because it was like 5.30 in the morning and I don't have fog lights on my car. So I literally couldn't see what I was turning into and it was scary. Seriously. Okay, so I just finished at the barn and it's about 1230. I didn't really do anything. I just kind of shadowed the girl who works there to, you know, learn everything. Um, I tried to count the buckets as she was filling them up. I think there are at least 29 horses, maybe at max 31. And then Hagen's coming, so that's just an adding another one. Um, so I didn't really record anything because the barn owner wasn't there and I didn't get to ask her if I could record anything. I mean, she's very private about everything. So when I took pictures of the practice, like I mentioned before, I can't post them unless I get permission. So I actually talked to the girl today and I'm sending her her pictures and I'll see if she'll let me post them. But I'm on my way home now and I should be coming back up here tonight and I think the barn owner should be there. So maybe I can record walking around or something, like looking at the barn. But either way, I'm really excited and I'll talk to you a little bit more about what the situation is whenever I get back to the apartment. And I can update y'all a little bit. So I know I said I was gonna tell y'all what was going on when I got to the apartment, but I fell asleep and I'm on my way back from the barn for the second time today after watching the girls ride. So, Dominic was supposed to go do a field problem and he was going to be gone for about a month and he was supposed to leave in July sometime, but they're not sure if they're doing it anymore. So if they do it, we were going to try to get leave in June, which they wouldn't let him turn in his packet, so we are not getting leave in June. So that cancels out the possibility of Hagen coming in July. Um, so what's going on now is either he goes to it, does his field problem and I get a plane and catch it to Texas and I go up there and spend my birthday in Texas with my family and then I bring Hagen back at the beginning of August or Dominic stays home and we get leave and we go still in July-ish uh, and still bring Hagen back in the beginning of August. So either way, Hagen will be up here in Georgia, hopefully with no problem at the beginning of August and I will have my horse and I'll be able to actually make videos with horses and not just me talking nonsense all the time. So you can comment below. Um, let me know any videos that y'all want to see or whatever. Any answer, answers, any questions for me. And um, go follow me on Instagram. That's where I'm going to be most active all the time on Instagram versus on here. And my Instagram is the period tranquil period trio. So go follow that.